getting off to a flying start as the goal at the beginning of any group stage. Match day one coming up at the European Championship. Which team will come storming out of the traps today? Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And it's match day one in the 2024 UEFA European Championship. It's Albania, and they take on Spain. Well, you have to be consistent in these group games. You can't afford to have an off day, otherwise you're out the running before... Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, that is a superb save. Nedim Bayrami and the starting 11 for Albania well on paper they look a very balanced team but the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward otherwise they might just lack a bit of penetration here's the lineup for Spain Grimaldo starts with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Oyarzabal plays with Ferran Torres out wide. And Morata is the main striker for this match. Really being closed down and didn't like it. Something to worry about here. Well, that's a really top-notch piece of defending. Marino. Better at Team CC now. Alvaro Morata, a wonderfully driven forward. And Stuart, you would have to suspect he's going to have something to say for himself here. Well, Derek, whether he's on the run, driven a shot, hitting a volley, or even shooting with the inside of his foot, he strikes the ball with such power. And this is why he beats the goalkeeper so often. He's a tremendous striker of the ball. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. Pedri. Strong but fair tackle. In with a chance. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, very effective play in possession. Might take the lead. And the ball is loose. And held by the keeper at the second time of asking. Well, he's just pulled off a great first save there. Now they can all calm down. And he's through here. Oh, what a clearance under pressure. Had to react and did. He's enjoying space. And making his move inside. Well, not troubling the goalkeeper at all there. And from that sort of distance, you should be troubling the goalkeeper. Technique let him down there. And Carvajal untidy in possession there. He must finish! Oh, yes! 1-0 it is! And it doesn't come as a huge surprise! Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Ferran Torres. It's looking promising. And the whistle is...
So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And the attack looks promising. Really good strong tackle and it'll be a throw in. He could pick out a teammate and a penalty it is. Well, when you're behind in the game, you certainly don't want to be conceding spot kicks. And on the back of that decision, now it's a caution. Well, it's a tight call, but in the end, I think he's got it right. A penalty and a yellow card. And the keeper denies them from the spot. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Good distribution. Well, great read there to intercept. Now, maybe room here for the counter-attack. Well, they promised much on the break, but ultimately delivered little. Chance to run at them. And he's broken free. And he's done it. Parity again. A magnificent game unfolding. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Well, we're into the final half hour. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Ball is loose. Well, they can bring it out now. Good run. Very much in control of the situation. They could nudge in front. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So there we have it. 2-1. Twenty minutes to go. Good ball over the top. Well read to put an end to that attack. Asani. Now based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. Delivered into the box. Miko Williams. A really good pass. And Spain struggling to keep the ball. Well, showing really good width here. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Must be! Out of play for a Spain throw-in. And they will make the change now. Moving forward effectively. This could be it! Brilliant save! So two minutes of stoppage time here. Is this the moment? Oh, he's blocked it! Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. Last line of defence. Well, coordinated. And there it is, the final whistle. Just what Spain were hoping for. They have delivered a victory, Stuart. Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win.
No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.